morning and here's the start of our ship tour. We are on deck, I think it's technically 19 because right below is 18 which is the jogging track. So deck 19 is the mini greens little putt putt golf, golf course thing, <laughs> golf greens with just a couple of holes um, and beautiful views. So let me turn this camera around so you can see that. We are currently in San Diego so you can see the naval base in the background but we just got a couple of holes here with beautiful panoramic views. I think it's a total of nine holes. And oh, that's what it's called, the Greens Mini Golf. We've got our clubs and our golf balls are in there. But yeah, this is the top of the ship. Uh, the Discovery Princess is definitely a lot taller than the Disney Wonder, which is right there next to us. See how high above we are from it. There's the jogging track below, that's deck 18, which I will go down and walk around. Also on deck 18, you can see down there we have the basketball court. Which people are playing oh, tennis right now too. So let's work our way down. You know, it's really bright out here right now at the jogging track. But uh, there was a sign that said seven laps equals one mile. This is a very wide jogging track for a ship. They're usually way more narrow, way more. It's a basketball court, people playing tennis. That was the back of the ship. Now we're working our way forward. I would take you all the way around, but probably don't need to go all the way around the docking track. We are approaching like the main pool area though up there. That's where I think the jogging track ends and then it turns around and works its way back to the back of the ship. So we will uh, I'll meet you when we get back to the back of the ship again here in a minute. So this is actually the big TV, the back of it. stand like right in front of it if you want. Here's the main pool deck. There's a TV. Can't really see it from this angle. It's pretty nice right now and calm and quiet. Oh. Sorry about that. The focus got really... Alright, so here on the jogging track you can see we are next to the Disney Wonder. This is the main pool area. It's very common for me right now because I think everybody's eating breakfast and uh, getting off the ship here in San Diego. It's a beautiful day though. This is as far as the jogging track goes and then it goes back around to the back of the ship. So let's go back to the back. All right, we're still on the jogging track, but at the end of the ship, uh, as you can see down here, we have the wake view pool. Wake pool. It has views of the wake when we're moving. Nobody down there. It is slightly heated though, but I haven't got in fooling myself. That is on deck 17 and well, the pool itself is on 16. Uh, the one here right below that down there, that's 17. So we're gonna go walk down here. Also the, the uh, smoking area is back here. Oh, on the deck I was just walking on. Now we go down to 16, which is the same deck as the buffet. There's a bar back here too. Wake the bar. And yeah. This is really cool pool though. Now as we work our way back this way, we'll be going through the buffet. There's, there might be a lot of people, so I have to film that later. Okay, yeah, a lot of people here, but I'll film this later. So do you make you wash your hands before you walk into the buffet? 
why they have six here. But right outside we have the main elevators that go to the piazza. Here is the sea view bar. This one's usually popping in the afternoon. We are down here now in the main pool, the one that I showed you from the jogging track. And this is deck 16. We're gonna go on the other side, see if I can show you the TV. So actually isn't anything on the TV right now, but they usually play like movies out here. Sometimes like football games. Back here we have the Salty Dog, the mixed cocktail bar, and then there's a pizza place over there. Those are all complimentary. Back here there's really nothing except for elevators. So that kind of ends deck 16. But if we go up these stairs here, go back up to 17, there is more. So up we go. So many stairs. Alright, here we go. So, these are actually two sky suites. Oh, sorry about that. Two sky suites back here. The other ones on the other side. They're very, very nice. Now, I don't know if it's. I think it is through here. Let's go in. Back here is the adults only pool. There's nobody in it. The retreat and the retreat bar. Also, I was on the ship too. I didn't really see anybody back here. But there's also staterooms right next to it, which give a cool view of the pool. And we can go out here to get a better look. Got music playing out here. Oh, and somebody in the jacuzzi up top. But yeah, bar's closed though. Maybe if it's like warmer weather, it's busier. And then they have the bar open. Alright, so let's continue this by going up even one more. So I believe we're back at 18. The jogging track is, but not accessible to here. Now this is the sanctuary. It's also an adults only area. You do have to pay extra to get in there, but it's more of like lounge chairs, small bites, um, fruit infused water. Not really much, kind of like a chill area. You can probably get a like, glimpse of it back there. Maybe. They have like some cabanas. But yeah, there's a sanctuary back here. It's open too, so it's not like enclosed. So if it's a cold day, might not be a lot of people. I kind of get a peek there. See kind of open air. Yeah, that's pretty much it back here. So now we're gonna go back to, well, we did all of 16. I guess now would be the lower decks because in between, I think 15 to like, eight or seven they're all like rooms so let's let's start going working our way down here okay so yeah so we're on deck 17 the sun deck 16 was the bistro the sliced pizzeria the ice cream all of that then until seven actually you get normal stuff because we did 18 17 yeah so 
there it is. Deck seven it is. Let's go. Well, these are all throughout the ship too. These are really cool. You can scan your medallion here and kind of shows you what you have saved as far as like events you want to attend. There's some games you can play on there as well too. So that's fun. Well, let's go to seven. I love these elevators though. They feel very spacious, very elegant. It's nice now when you get them to yourself. Deck 12. Oh, oh. oh we're, we're, we're going to seven. Actually, you're the theater is back there. Like they're getting ready for excursion so we'll go see that princess theater later now here are all the shops most of them they're all closed right now because we're at port so tomorrow's a sea day i can come and kind of check out more but oh i love how quiet and calm the ship is when a lot of people are getting off the ship see they got like all kinds of things everything's tax-free Stanley the Bears Princess Cruz mascot got tons of versions of him oh I love a little captain that's a cop so they have Christmas stuff Christmas cups they got the Ensenada stuff. Well, we're gonna stop in Ensenada Sunday. So they got like that kind of like Mexican inspired art. I have my eye trying to find a Christmas ornament. How do we not ever see this? Like, what's Tommy Bahamas? Walking here. We've got like fragrances, Pandora, Swarovski. Yeah, again, the main princess shop here. And uh, yeah, so Princess Theater is the very back over there. You can go look at that later. Um, at deck seven, we've got Bellini's bar. We have a uh, bistro sur la mer. I know I'm pronouncing that wrong. This one is a signature dining, so it's like a French restaurant that is an upcharge. On the other side, we have Gigi's Pizzeria. That's included. The only thing is, like, you get a whole pizza. Oh, I mean, it's personal but it's so big and uh, I can't finish all of that it's a lot but here it is it is really good though they like freshly make the dough and everything so here's again the Bellini's bar now we have hit the piazza which you get deck seven six and five five is the lowest that we can go that's public There is more back here, so let's keep walking. So they have an area here where they do a lot of like game shows and stuff up ahead. Also where they sell the medallion accessories. Seems where they sell a lot of the medallion accessories. I like that cocktail set. <laughs> Princess Live Cafe Bar. Here's a Princess Live Theater, a little smaller theater. This is where they do all the game shows and trivia. 
It's a very nice venue. Back here we have the Crown Grill, which is the signature dining and steakhouse. There's also a Crown View, Crown Grill, sorry, bar. It's back here. Bar, piano player. That room back there, when it's lit up again, I'm gonna show it to you. But I took a video of it when I went to Alaska. It's beautiful. There's like wine bottles all the way around it. The actual restaurant is behind the bar back there, but you can just come out here and sit at the bar. Now, way back here is the Vista Lounge. This they do like bingo. Uh, at night they have a DJ playing music. There's not much going on right now. Because again, it's port day. Just so you can see this venue. They do have a bar back here too. Nobody's at the bar. Right now, this is the Vista Lounge. And uh, people will be dancing out there too when they have the DJ playing. Fun. Yeah, that's pretty much all of deck seven. All right, to go to deck six, let's take the stairs. There is a sushi place that's right there on deck six. This is my favorite bar, Crooner. There's a piano player there, too. Ooh, coffee sounds good, actually. Uh, not much back here. This is one of the main dining rooms. Skagway. People like to go there for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. That's when you want like sit down environment. We have a photo gallery. Head. We've got the senior officers posted. Here's another shop. This is more watches. And other jewelry. So people are getting off the ship. And then the casino, which is closed on port days. Should be able to film since there's nobody playing. Oh, there is another venue, Take 5, that's back there. I think it's kind of like a jazz thing. Jazz music type of bar. So we've got all the slots here. Tons and tons. This is a pretty big casino. I've seen uh, smaller ones on other ships. Place is busy, but all the tables for roulette, blackjack. And at the very back too, they have like a Texas Hold'em thing as well. Here too, you can buy scratchers, your cards for deal or no deal. So they actually have this on the ship where uh, you can buy these deal or no deal cards, and if you do, you get a chance to actually be in the show. And it's just like deal or no deal. Um, except the suitcases are all like digital on a screen. And, um, and if you don't get chosen to go up, you can uh, still win from having those cards as well. Over here's another entrance to Princess Live. Or not Princess Live. I keep confusing Princess Theater with Princess Live. Princess Live is that like King Show area. So let me see if I can get a peek of the theater. Right, like I said, they're getting ready for shore excursions. So I might have to come back later. But let's, let's see. Yeah, I think we're gonna come back. Everybody's in section two.
we shall return. So now we're on deck five, which is the lowest deck. We have the Juno dining room. So all three dining rooms, Juno, Skagway, and Ketchikan are all named after different ports in Alaska. And they're playing Sugar Ray right now. We've got Internet Cafe. And celebrations by like sundries and booze. The gelato, which is closed right now. Salty Dog Gastro Pub. This is a specialty dining upcharge. Back here, we have the specialty Italian restaurant, Sabatini's. Get an upcharge for this place. have our shore excursions desk, we have the like concierge, and this is the lotus spa in the back. Over here is the international cafe, we have like small bites 24 hours a day, there's a long line for coffee right now. And here is the good spirits at sea bar. Another exit to get off the ship here. So this is actually the main theater, Princess Theater, on the Discovery Princess. Doing a quick video because there's actually nobody in here right now. It is quite beautiful. Seats are nice. I love that pretty much anywhere that you sit, you'll get a good view. Right now they're showing just like a princess video, but this is where all the shows will take place in the evening. And yeah, one of the prettier uh, theaters that I have seen on most ships.